Let's begin with CBS 46's Yasmina Alston, who spoke with a doctor today about the risk factors we need to know about. Yasmina. Well, we found out your risk depends on your age, your health, and of course, where you've recently traveled. But another thing we wanted to know is how does the coronavirus compare to the seasonal flu? A doctor answered that question for us today. So much like with flu, Anybody who now gets sick feels like they have the coronavirus, and it's completely understandable. As concerns over the coronavirus grow, we take a look at the symptoms and how they compare to the flu. Dr. Rocco Romeo with Atlanta Urgent Care says symptoms for both can include fever, cough, and shortness of breath. Let's not forget people were feeling that way before coronavirus ever got mentioned. We asked Romeo, should you panic if you experience those symptoms? He says no. But why don't we see the same panic with the seasonal flu? The problem is people have gotten accustomed to the flu. They know it happens. They know people survive. They know what to do. They know to come see us. They know how to take care of themselves. Now, Romeo says if you're considered more at risk and have traveled to certain places like China within a certain time frame, you may want to go to the emergency room. If that doesn't apply to you, go to your regular doctor. You're concerned about it all because people don't cover their mouths and all. Regardless, people are still concerned and taking precautions. Tremaine Hall says specifically for the coronavirus. I'm, I'm not trying to get sick. I don't want to catch any viruses or anything. And as always, Dr. Romeo says to cover your mouth and to wash your hands and try not to touch your mouth as much to limit that spread. Live from the Atlanta airport, Yasmina Alston, CBS 46 News.